Is it? Is it? Is it this house? Is it, should I get some sort of priest or some some to exorcise the demons? Because that that's how sports superstitions work. Every game at your place, victory for the Bruins. Yep. Every game here, victory for the Leafs. Yep. Um, that 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 period was considerably more exciting than oh, yes. the other ones. Oh yeah. Uh, it, it did finally broke break wide open. Uh, but first of all, we got the, the Bruins got their first penalty where they were called for too many men on the ice. Which uh, is, again, the it's the worst. It's the dumbest penalty. The worst penalty. I mean, not for, like, it, it's not for fighting, it's not tripping, it's not hooking, it's not even interference. It's, it's you can't count. You can't do that. <laughs> Basic that. Right? Uh, so, but that, that, they did manage to kill that. Uh, uh, Matthews was the one who, who kind of broke it open. Uh, he got uh, the assists from uh, Kapanen and Muzzinen. Muzzin? Muzzin. Muzzin? And good on him. He had a kid yesterday. Oh, there you go. Look, I dedicate that one to his rotten brat. <laughs> um, so that, that, put, that, that put the Leafs on the board. It was um, challenged. And the, yes, there was some, some controversy there uh, because it looked like uh, they had thought that there was some, um, some interference there. Uh, that uh, that was not the case, uh, unfortunately for me. Unfortunate for these guys, uh, but it was it was not uh, it was not called as goaltender interference. So so that that gave them the, that that one goal, and then Kapanen, uh, he got he got a goal that was not contested in any way, shape, or form for goalie interference. Uh, with, the, with the assist from Riley and Jonsson with two S's. Um, finally, uh, the, 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 the Bruins did get onto the board. Uh, Bergeron got a, got a goal with 53 seconds or 43 seconds left in the game, something like that. And with the extra man, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Wait. Yes, because they had pulled the, they had pulled the goal. Pulled the tender. Goal tender. Goal Stop out. it! How many times did they pull the goalie? Oh my... <laughs> But I had a second round? You know, you you actually, from my understanding, you, you were actually only able to do that like three times a day, max. That depends on your age and... Well, I mean, if you, if you take, if four if you take a break for a week. But, um, so they, they got that, and there was some controversy to that. There, there was a, a possible offside, they had thought, and uh, that was challenged uh, by the Leafs, uh, but it was not to be uh, as... Both controversies were were deemed as non-controversies because uh, both goals were upheld, um, and I'm going to say it, it, that that last flurry of, of offense in the last minute, well, the Bruins lost, but not for trying because there were they they were t fighting tooth and nail. Uh, there, were, there was one time I couldn't believe that the Bruins didn't score because Anderson didn't have a stick. Yeah, it was sprawled out, belly down, on his stomach, no stick. And they, they didn't get it in. So uh, the Bruins are definitely having a hard night tonight. Um, and, uh, the so defense did their job. They did their job, yes. And, and, and both goaltenders did fantastic. They did, they did both of them. So, I mean, uh, kudos to everyone involved. Uh, oh, look at this. Don Sherry with his, uh, his Pac-Man coat from the other night. Delightful. Um, so, yeah. Um, so we're, get, we're going back to Toronto. And that game is going to be on Sunday. Um, I won't be covering that uh, because I will be elsewhere, possibly. Um, if I do find the opportunity, I may find a recap and at least at the very least, I can run down some numbers for you and, and post that up. But uh, Sean and Kateri won't be here. But I, I must say, I've been having a really good time doing this. It's been a pleasure. Um, and then I, I feel. Um, I feel it's something that we should we, we should definitely continue to do. Definitely. Yes. Mm. Even just to do Boston Leafs games next year, regular season. Oh, there you go. I I, I can get behind that. Um. So uh, yes. <sighs> so yep, the uh, Leafs are up three three to two in this series. I don't know. Don't, 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 don't. Yeah, three two. Be careful. Be careful. It's the sort of thing that you know no. you, you know how sports superstitions yeah. work. Yeah. Celebrate too soon, and we, we might have to we, 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 we might have to go somewhere else to watch the game though, because we can't watch it. Anymore. Right? Yeah. Do you want to do me a favor? Watch it at your house. Do not go out anyways that night or that day, because it's it's Sunday in the afternoon, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so so do tune in for that. Um, despite the fact that your your good friend Montrose uh, won't be uh, doing uh, intermission to intermission updates, uh, but it, it it does look like it's going to be a really good good game. Um, all I can say is go Bruins, and uh, hopefully, hopefully I will be talking to you on every Tuesday at that point, won't it? 
Yeah, Game 7 would be Tuesday. Is there not, there's not some weird there scheduling is, thing? I don't if think so. Stop it. That's why I said hopefully I'll be talking to you Tuesday. Because I want there to be a Game 7. And then a Game 1 again for the Bruins. So, uh, but, uh, but we will find out. Um, and uh, if, if that is the case... Um, I, I will be keeping you updated. Uh, but until then, I've been Montrose Monkington, the third Esquire. This has been Sean Kateri. This has been Game 5. Thank you. More later.